It's the season of love, everybody. Valentine's Day is soon, and wedding season's right around the corner. So, whether you're looking for a romantic getaway, or an amazing spot to spend some quality time together on your honeymoon, we have you covered with these three amazing hotel options in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Stick around, because we'll give you those options right after that intro. Roll that intro. I just want to see the light. Hi all, Keith here. Welcome to the video. Before we go too much further, make sure you pause the video, click that subscribe button, and ring that notification bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Also, smash that like button and let's get into it. In this one, we're giving you three great hotel options for your next romantic getaway, or maybe you're planning your honeymoon. Either way, these hotels will be great for you and that special someone. So our options here are going to range from budget-friendly to money's not an object. Our only rule here is we're choosing actual hotels in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. If you want that special getaway in a condo or a cabin, I'll link a playlist up here. You can check out some great options we found in the Gatlinburg and Pigeon Forge, Tennessee areas. So first up, let's check out the budget-friendly options there in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. So first off, I want to just say in the budget-friendly area, there's a range of hotels in Gatlinburg. Sometimes the pictures don't always match what you're getting, and that $50 hotel room turns out to be a a little scary when you get there. So just make sure if you're booking a budget friendly option that you really check out like TripAdvisor and all the reviews and maybe all the videos you can find on it because the last thing you want to do is be on a romantic getaway and have the hotel ruin everything for you. But anyway, speaking from experience, our budget hotel is a great option at a great price point and that hotel is the Edgewater Hotel in Gatlinburg. They have some of the best views in town and the rooms have been up updated in the last few years. Pro tip though, as for a creek view room so you get the best view the hotel has, you can get a jacuzzi queen room or a king suite and most of the time the price is going to range anywhere from $130 to $150 per night, which is a great budget friendly option compared to most hotels there in Gatlinburg. The Edgewater also does offer free breakfast, although I'm not sure how it is with today's situation, so you may want to check before you go, but the free breakfast will help you save even more money on your romantic getaway or honeymoon. Just a few things to be aware about this hotel though. The parking garage is a little tight, especially for larger vehicles. And the elevators are slow and can get quite crowded during busy peak times. But if you play it around that, it won't be too bad. This hotel has such an amazing location in the heart of the action in Gatlinburg, back on River Road. So it's way more peaceful than any hotel would be on the Strip. You and your special someone will enjoy sitting on the balcony and enjoying the sights and sounds of Gatlinburg from the edge water hotel in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Our pick for mid-range hotel is going to be the Park Vista. This hotel sits up on the side of the mountain, away from the hustle and bustle of Gatlinburg, but it is on the trolley route if you don't want to drive when you're in town. The rates here usually start around 175-ish, but can get around 300 a night if you're picking a suite. Our pick here would be the One King City View Room, because we've stayed in this room type before at this hotel, and the views are simply amazing. It's great just to sit on your balcony and enjoy the views of Gatlinburg. And you're far enough away you don't get any of that city noise. It's amazing. The other thing we like about this hotel is the pool area here is very nice. It almost feels like a watering hole in the great smoky mountains that you've just found. They have hot tubs and a fun water slide. Now the cons for this hotel are kind of personal preference really. You're not going to be in the heart of the action of Gatlinburg because you're kind of up on the side of the mountain which makes the drive to this hotel a little nerve wracking. It's not too bad. And there's no free breakfast here. Although I think they do offer an option if you're like a Hilton Honors Gold member or above but not everyone's going to get that option. Still this is a great hotel tucked away from the hustle and bustle of Gatlinburg with amazing views. You might just even see a bear too. It's a great place to connect with that someone special for your romantic getaway or 
even your honeymoon. All right, if you're enjoying this video so far, make sure you smash that like button for me. Now, if money is no object for you and you want to have the most unique and maybe awesome experiences in the heart of downtown Gatlinburg, we would choose the Margaritaville Resort. Now, honestly, even just the regular stated rooms here are probably a hundred times better than most stated rooms in any of the other hotels in Gatlinburg, mostly because of the size and just the amenities you get at this place. But we're not talking stated rooms here. No, money's no option for this one, right? So if money is no option, we would suggest Jimmy's Hideaway here at the Margaritaville Resort Gatlinburg. Jimmy's Hideaway is literally your own cottage right there at the Margaritaville Resort in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. It's right on the Little Pigeon River and right next to their Saint Somewhere Spa. From the romantic four-post bed, jetted tub, two-person shower, and relaxing views from your private cottage, this place cannot be beat if money's no object because this hotel room ranges anywhere from $500 to $1,000 a night just depending on the time of year and what's happening in Gatlinburg. But when you stay at Jimmy's Hideaway, you still get the great amenities of the Margaritaville, including the spa, the pool, and the restaurants. But you'll have the most exclusive room in town. Honestly, I was trying to find some negatives about this hotel, but there aren't really many major flaws to it. The only thing I would say is we've had problems with the housekeeping here before, and most of the time that's just because they're like a little slow, like we haven't had seen the housekeeper till four or five o'clock in the afternoon sometimes. <laughs> but that's just a minor inconvenience for this place because Jimmy's Hideaway at the Margaritaville Resort in Gatlinburg is the perfect place for you and your special someone to hide away from it all. You may never want to leave your cottage. All right, those are our three hotel selections for your next romantic getaway or your honeymoon in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Which one would you choose? Let me know in the comments down there below. All right, everyone, we're going to wrap this one up here, but make sure you hang out for just a little bit longer because we'll have some end cards with some video suggestions and we'd love it if you'd watch another video. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Click that subscribe button down there below to find out all the great benefits of becoming a member of the channel. Also, check out our merch shelf down there below. We have some cool new designs that are teasing some upcoming videos. I'll go ahead and also link our coffee page up here so you can check that out too. It's just a way for you to drop us a virtual tip or buy us a coffee. Any way you choose to support the channel, we really appreciate it. I'd also like to pause here for a moment and thank all of you that made it this far into the video. Y'all are really in it with us and we appreciate you more than you know. Say romance is in the air down there below in the comments to let me know you made it this far into the video. All right, everyone, we'll catch you in the next video. Thanks a lot for watching. Peace and love.